Good morning, guys. Welcome to Shargao, to sadly our final day on this incredible island. Oh, love waking up, just coming out here straight away. It's a nice day today. Hope you're all doing well. Thanks for clicking on the video. Um, if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. We upload every single day travel vlogs. Currently, two months in the Philippines. I think we're like a month in now, which is kind of crazy. We did a month in January, that flew by. This month has flew by already. So I'm very, very glad that we've still got a whole nother month. Lucy is just having a quick shower. Then I need to shower because I don't know if you can see this, but my hair, I've got like, this is seawater, salt water hair. <laughs> we had a great day yesterday. If you saw the vlog, um, island hopping, um, absolutely insane. I didn't realize there was some really, really stunning islands just off the coast of Shargao. My favorite one was Guyam Island, which was the small round one. Such chilled vibe on there, mango shakes great day. Today's plan once we get ready is to go and get some breakfast, get some coffee. We're going to a place called Shaka. They ran out of coffee for the last few days so we haven't been but apparently coffee's back. They do some incredible fruit bowls. Last day of riding our lovely motorbike. Can't be sad though because we've got a fun few days coming up. Got my party shirt on today guys. Every day's a party. With me. My ears sticking out. It's a little you, weird. Yeah a little bit. Are you ready? Uh, I need to brush my hair. Just getting the thumbnail ready for tonight's video. Sorry about the, <laughs> the late upload the other day. Basically, the internet here isn't the fastest. Um, it's okay, but we set the video to upload overnight. Um, well, it was uploading from like maybe 5 o'clock or something, 5 p.m. We try and upload at 7 p.m. every day. And yeah, it didn't work. So we left it uploading. Thought it might go on at 11 or 12. We went to sleep. Woke up at seven in the morning, it was on 50%. So I hope you enjoyed the Saturday morning vlog. Let us know what time works for you guys as well uploading. We try for seven, but we can't, that's just really a guess to think people are home from work, people are chilling in the evening, they wanna watch something, but um, let us know if a different time would work better for you. Yeah. So we've come to Shaka again this morning. Um, we love the fruit bowls here. However, their coffee machine has been broken. Ugh. I said this for already. the last three days. Yeah. yeah. So we've come here now uh, for one final trip before we leave. Um, but we wanted to get one last fruit bowl in. I think Mike's here editing. Somewhere. I saw his bike. I think he's here. I can see his helmet on the table. There he is. I'm glad they got coffee. Me too. There he is. Hi. How are you? Very good. How are you? I'm good. <laughs> Morning. Morning. <laughs> like a spider. <laughs> lunch <laughs> it's only a fruit like some fruit for breakfast this is our last day on the island i think you mentioned yeah. so <laughs> we are, what <laughs> like oh, they've been here. so wonky recently there we go these are these are fake ray-bans that i bought Same. for like oh, a dollar yeah somewhere um anyway yes yeah, so our last day on the island so we've had to go back to the room we had to pack up a little bit got some laundry um, done yeah got a laundry done yeah all the boring stuff that we have to do sometimes i quite like doing laundry now, i like getting laundry back anyway Come to a place called Kitia's place, and we're gonna get some some lunch, and then maybe check the beach out after. Please. Yes, please. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very much. So tomorrow we're getting up early. We have a flight booked to Boracay. No, Boracay. No? Boracay. Boracay. All right. Boracay. Not Boracay. Who All right. Are you? I'm British. My accent's different. Sorry about that. Um, we have to fly to Cebu first, I believe. Mm -hmm. Uh, a couple of hours at the airport, Hello. you'll see it all tomorrow, and then we'll be there. We we first went, let us know if you're watching the channel when we first went, because we went in, I think November or December last year, they had just reopened it. It was two yeah. weeks just opened. Three weeks, I think. Um, so it'd be interesting to go back. There was so much construction going on there. A huge amount, it was like, the beach was amazing. It was really nice and clean, but behind the beach was just like building work. Every single restaurant yeah. cafe had building work being done. It did, so it'd be very interesting to see how the progress is getting but on. It's not been, it's only been a few months. I can't imagine it being like completely Yeah, but they were working different. through the night. I know, 
Copenhagen. It's a tonight. lot of work. We're spending a few days there, then we're off Are we to a place. This? Not yet. Then yeah. we're off to a place that I hadn't even heard of. Have you said it in your vlog yet? No. Okay. Okay. All right. We can't. We can't say it if they're not saying it. <laughs> um, we're off to a place that I hadn't heard of, and from photos, it looks absolutely amazing. So we've got yes. a few days there. Um, very exciting. It's very. I think there's not a lot going on there at all. We looked up things to do there and it was like five things to do. Two of them were the same, another two were the same and one was kind of a normal thing to do. Like there's not loads going on but it should be nice to it like relax. It should be really interesting to and see And enjoy it. how, I think the main thing of that place, the secret place, is that it, like how beautiful it is. I think that's the main part. But get your guesses below. I'm sure some of you will get it right. Comment below where you think we're you going You guys are usually after. good at guessing where we're off to. This looks good. Mm. Really good. Tasty. Mine's on the way. I've got pasta coming. But this is great. Oh, one I of our. I was too lazy to pick it up chopsticks, so I stabbed it. <laughs> one of our final meals here. Yeah. Oh, we've got a nice meal tonight. We're going back to Kermit's for pizza. Yes. Taking a little stroll down to the beach to not swim, because we're not wearing swimming stuff, just, are you? Damn, I forgot my swimming stuff yesterday as well. Ah, yeah. uh, this is nice. Oh, this is like, apparently there's somewhere called Secret Beach. We haven't found it. Sadly, we're not gonna have time to go and look for it um, because we leave tomorrow morning. But this yeah, is this, this is cool actually. It's just like oh, little just... kids playing and- Yeah, this is so nice. Up. I guess these are the boats that people use for the island shopping. Yeah. Oh yeah, look, there's so, loads of boats here but no one really on this beach. Oh, this is nice. We can sit here for a bit. We hope you enjoyed the Q&A video the other day. It was like 30 minutes, well, I think it was like 20 or 30 minutes long. We got some really nice comments and everyone was like, oh, answer some more questions. You didn't ask, answer my questions. So yeah, let's just sit and chill and chat. Ah, uh, it was funny. Earlier, I was on our YouTube channel, um, not watching our videos. We don't, there's actually some vlogs of ours that I haven't seen Same. and vice versa. If Lucy, sometimes if Lucy edits, then I don't have time to watch the vlog and then I forget about it. So there's definitely videos you guys have seen that we haven't seen even though we were in them. I was on the channel and the video that comes up when you click on our channel page is us announcing to the world and to everyone who was following us at the time that we were quitting our jobs in the UK, selling everything we owned, all our stuff, um, getting rid of our apartment and moving out and buying a one-way ticket to Asia. Yeah. We started in Thailand and that was kind of crazy to watch. It said seven months ago. So and weird, it was us that? saying, we're going to do YouTube full time, we're going to daily vlog. We're we were gonna... like, we've never daily vlogged, like we've always wanted to. Yeah, um, it was... And it was when we had, I think, 6,300 subscribers. Uh, and this is really weird to watch back because like the people we were then had no idea if we would be able to do this. Yeah. And we were just kind of confident. We were like, you know what, let's just give it a go. And that's like, I think so important to know that if you've got this idea, if you've got some dream or a goal you want to reach, just like, do what you can, try your hardest and... To make it happen. Yeah, exactly. And since then, so last August, apart from a few small breaks, but not for longer than like a day, we have daily vlogs. Yeah. Seven months of daily vlogs, so filming crazy. our life every single day, speaking to you guys. Um, pick... Mike, would you stop doing that? <laughs> And the community is just growing every single day, which we are amazed about yeah. and so, so grateful. So if you watch these videos, thank Always. you so much. Look, there's an island hopping tour coming back. Is that? Yeah, look. Yeah, nice. This reminds me, remember when we were in... Oh, uh, El Nido. El Nido, yeah. and there was like typhoon, and there was these people trying to come back, and yeah. they were trying to get off the boat to come to shore, and there were huge waves, and everyone was just like falling over and like holding their belongings yeah, in like non... Hardly... Non in non-waterproof bags above their heads. They could getting, hardly get back onto the beach. Knocked over by the waves. It's yeah. crazy. This is a lot calmer. This is so, so nice. I'm surprised no, not more like tourists are down here, because it's literally just local. Maybe this is secret beach. The water's so clear. <laughs> Hello, doggy. Hello. Aww. Hello. So Hello. cute. Hello. Hello, mate. Gonna take over the vlog. Oi. Hello. Aww. On what Lucy was saying about um, going for things in life, you, you sometimes just have to, like we, started to not see any other alternative. We knew we wanted to give YouTube a go, go traveling and enjoy, see what the world had to offer. We were in a place where we'd saved up a bit of money. We just went for it. 6,000 subscribers went for it. But, yeah, um, it's so crazy looking back. It is. I feel like at the time people were like, oh, it's so risky. And at the time I was like, no, it's not. But now looking back, I'm like, that's actually quite crazy. The thing is people, 
a lot of people spend too much time worrying about what other people are doing. So there were people who were way more concerned about us doing this than we were. Um, and I don't know, I just, we've never, I've never had the time to worry about what anyone else is doing. And Sorry, I'm totally distracted by this dog. You carry on. And if, <laughs> and the only thing I can pass on is that that, for me, that is such a key thing. Mm. If you just spend all your time concentrating on yourself and what you want to achieve, block out any noise, any negativity, um, be self-aware enough to know that it, you know, it could work. Like we knew this could work. But we also knew that it might not work. And we were very, like you said, self-aware. We were very aware of yeah. that. Yeah. But we didn't listen to that part as much because otherwise we wouldn't have tried and we wouldn't be here now. Yeah. Um, and another thing with like not listening to other people, if we cared too much about what other people think, or other people think this would be a really bad job to have because definitely we get hate we get people that dislike our videos like we're fine. we are lucky in the sense that 99.9 percent .9 of our comments on our channel yeah. are amazing really nice, amazing so so, so lovely uh, which we love reading through leave a comment we always try and reply or give it a heart um we get a lot of comments now which is incredible so but we read yeah. we I, I would say we read every single comment um at, i would say we read nearly every single comment um, and reply to as many as we possibly can. Yeah, yeah. But that that is in, that's incredible. A lot of people who just meet us now or don't know the full story, kind of, we get called lucky. We get told that oh, I couldn't do that. I couldn't do that. But no, we're not. We're not anyone special. We yeah. we've made videos on YouTube. I think the first three years on YouTube, three or four years, our videos were getting maybe like three to five hundred views. Uh, yeah, but way less. Start with. Yeah, we've never done it for money. We've never done it for, um, I don't know, fame. notoriety or fame yeah. or anything like that, or to make other people think that we've got a cool life or anything like that. Some Sometimes vloggers get a bit of a bad name, but we only made videos because we found it fun. It's yeah, just simple as that. Yeah, purely out of fun. And we kept going, even when the views were small, we just we just kept going, uploading, uploading, uploading. And we didn't keep going to try and get big. It wasn't like, no. oh, this video didn't get views. What do we do next time differently? Yeah. We were just like, oh, cool. So we've uploaded that video. Like, we film next because if we wanted to we probably could have done something crazy that we might have thought we might have got more views we always said that like people jump on trends people do like things that are currently happening try and jump on that to have a video that explodes and then everyone follows them from that but i feel like we've kind of been more steady we just and only yeah. uploaded stuff we wanted to talk about we just uploaded whatever happens in our life like yeah. we just we used to upload vlogs that was just in our flat we'd make a morning coffee make some breakfast go back and watch them if you haven't go and it's do such something a different life. it's weird have fun hang out with our friends yeah. like we just we just filmed whatever we wanted and had fun along the way that's the most important thing i've also met people who wanted to start a youtube channel because they thought it was easy um it's fun but it's not i wouldn't say it's easy i mean it's not the hardest job in the we world there are obviously we don't complain about it being hard because we enjoy it but yeah. hard doesn't necessarily mean a bad thing. Hard's it's, not necessarily a bad word. Yeah, and work doesn't and work doesn't need to have negative connotations. Yeah. So we work very hard to get these daily videos out to our Instagrams, so obviously like brand stuff, emails, blah, blah blah. But we love it. So it's not when we go, oh, we've done so much work today, or we're working so hard. We don't mean it in like an oh. Yeah, we're not complaining. Oh, it's so much to do. Like we love, we absolutely love what we do. And I hope that comes across the in the best videos. Job. Yeah. Best thing we've ever done. So we basically just sat down to chill, but end up having this conversation. Yeah. Yeah. Probably a conversation we would have had on our on our own, mm. but we decided to hold the camera out. Um, As always. All right, guys, we're gonna we're gonna let you watch what we're watching right now for a few seconds, and then then it'll probably be dinner time. <laughs> So we just had a friend, we just moved, but we had a friend who came over and just lied right in the middle of us both here. Yeah. Um, but he's now gone to chill over there. Oh, doggy right. friend. We've just been listening to a podcast, True Geordie interviewing Ricky Gervais. Haven't had time, as well, since Christmas to watch anything or to listen to anything. So I thought I'd take like 15 minutes now whilst we're just sitting on the beach just to listen to something that isn't the sound of my own voice while I'm editing my own vlog. <laughs> it's quite nice. These dogs are hilarious. They just keep coming and sitting underneath George's legs and they don't listen. You call them over, they don't come. And then when you don't call them, they come. There they are. Oh, oh. now they get bored. Oh, they've been in the sea as well. Oh, where? Ah. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Hello, boy. Oh, Hello. wow. 
Oh god, the kid's back with the cup of water. <laughs> this kid keeps giving them a bath with what? <laughs> like running after him with a cup. Oh, the dogs no, are really no, like good. lying next to I know, us. they're so affectionate on this island. The dogs just want to be loved. It's so cute. Aww. Aww. That kid's scheming is next. Revenge He's up to something, isn't He's he? up to something. He's now got a pot of sand. He's thinking to himself, all right, I've done this. Now what? Oh, it's really resting on me. Oh, I'm sneezing at you. Lovely. No, don't encourage it. <laughs> We're just heading out to Kermit's again for our final meal here in Shark oh, Alpha. Oh, oh, oh. I know, I'm really I don't sad. want to leave, really. Me too. Uh, but it's our favourite, probably our favourite place of food here. Um, and we've also got to give our bikes back on the way. Last time, but it feels busy. See. There's about three million scooters yeah, true. in the car park. Delicious calamansi minchi. Oh, that's nice. Fresh. So you were shrugging your shoulders and closed off. That's what I told you. Soon enough, everything started to change. Oh, goodbye, bye. Um, guys, if you're coming here, this was Mike's bike that he, this was Mike's bike that he swapped. It's really nice bikes, loose keys. This is the place. If you guys want to rent uh, motorbikes, if you're coming to Chargao, the bikes we've been riding, you probably get on exactly the same bikes that we've been on. Um, this is the place to do it. Great owners, really friendly people here. And this vlog here. Actually, I'm gonna switch over to my co-host, Lucy. What? How great I am? Yeah, you guys seem to be. Like in Lucy on the vlog. More than George. More than me, so. And I've still got the lowest amount of followers on Instagram, so. That's alright. That's alright. We know why. Right, thanks for watching today. We hope you enjoyed it. Give it a big thumbs up if you did. Getting a trip back to the hotel now. Ooh. We're getting picked up at like half five or six o'clock tomorrow morning. We've got two flights, a big wait in an airport, but all good fun. What's up? I had to get back to my bike. Always, always. On that note, bye. bye.